Hey guys, gonna do another update. Not done anything in a while, basically, because not really had anything to show. But, well, here's another iPod I've got. The other one, I left it out in the rain and it died. Well, it still works, it's just can't plug it into the computer. And it doesn't charge. Um, I'm about to get the flywheel off this so I can change that key. Uh, where did I put the key? Oh crap. Hmm. That's typical. I'll find that in a minute, but I stole that out of that we push over there. So that should work and hopefully I'll have a nice running engine now. Ready to build my little go-kart thingy out of. This Murray 830 should be sold pretty soon. I need to sort that tire out because that that's needs a tube, that's knackered. Um but as you can see it's got a deck on it now. I think it's 28 inch cut. I custom made all the mountain brackets and stuff for it. Good old cable ties holding it up. Uh, but it works. I just need to get a belt on it now and then make a clutch pulley set up. Gonna use the one out of the one I used to have in my modding tractor before I destroyed that. Got a pulley and the spindle and the blade and all that. That's nice and nice and free. That's full enough. Um, I'll just quickly show you what I'm doing with the lean to around the back. So hopefully, once I've got that built, I can keep all the tractors and the motorbikes and stuff out of the garage and just keep this clear for working on, you know, single projects at a time. So here's the back garden. There's that twin sitting lonely. It's not been started in the last since the last time I showed you it, actually. But I've dug all this out. Tons and tons of dirt. And I still need to dig all the way back there. I need to dig it all down to that level. I'm standing up here. There's quite a lot of dirt. It's three garage lengths to do. And it's at least two tractors wide, so I can fit tons in here. And it's pretty tall as well. Um, there's the old John Serrett I've still not started. I'll get a video of that soon about, you know, redneck tire beading or whatever you call it because they need putting back on this is the trailer and here is my car yeah, I told some of you that I bought a 1 litre polo for my first car so this is it it's not the greatest car but it's pretty decent I like it it's got 15 inch Fox alloys and well, I've not got the key on me now. Actually, I might do, I don't know. I mean, it's pretty good, it's got a few scuffs around it, they want me. But clear indicators and all this stuff as well. Gonna maybe tint the back lights black as well, so I'm nice and smart. I'll do a start up of this later, probably. Can't remember if I just said that, but. Wait, 